What is going on guys? Tall Fisherman Jay here and today I am back with another fun challenging fishing video. Now I scoured the internet you guys. I was searching for hours and hours and hours making sure that this video didn't exist. I was the first one on YouTube to do this and that is the $25 Walmart fishing challenge. JK, it's been done 150,000 times. Kidding, this challenge has been done plenty and plenty of times. All the fishing guys on YouTube have done it, except myself, and I wanted to try it out and see how I can do. Now, what I love about this challenge is that it shows you guys, all the fans and subscribers out there, that you don't need expensive, crazy gear to catch fish. And you can spend 25 bucks at Walmart and go out and catch fish all day. So that is what I love about this challenge. That is the reason why I'm doing this challenge. So today we're gonna set out, we're gonna go to Walmart, we're gonna have $25, that is it. We're gonna get rod, we're gonna try and get rod, reel, line, lures, hooks, weights, and that's it. Uh, something might change when I get there because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to handle that with $25, but that's the goal right now. We'll see how we can do. So let's go ahead, head outside to Walmart and get this challenge started. All right, you guys, we have made it to, I don't wanna get copywritten. We have made it to Walmart. There she is, the infamous Walmart. So we're gonna head inside. I don't know how I feel about this, you guys. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get all that stuff for $25, but I sure hope we will, and I sure hope we're gonna catch some fish today. So we're gonna go ahead and park and head inside. I'm excited. Oh, look at that. That is sweet. Goals. Old man goals. Here we are. The infamous fishing section of Walmart. Now we have $25, you guys. We need rod, we need everything. Rod, reel, line, hooks, weights, lures. And I think, I think I'm gonna be able to do it. I don't know. Let's see what the cheapest, the cheapest rod, <laughs> here we go. Cheapest reel is this Zebco push button. Oh boy. And it's right hand retrieve. I don't know. Now we don't want to eliminate quality in this in this uh, in this challenge. This this is not like I'm just gonna get like a Barbie rod or something like that. I want to actually get some decent stuff, some quality items for under twenty five dollars. So I think we're gonna have to go with one of these one of these reels. We don't want to spend too much money on a reel, but we're gonna try. So as I look closer and closer to all this stuff, I think the best thing we have to do is to actually go with one of these combos, which comes with rod reel and sometimes line on it already. So we're gonna look for a combo. There's so many of them. That one doesn't look that bad. Here's a nice combo. Spinning combo, short rod, but little reel, but this will get the job done. Let's see how much this is. So this here is $11.84. So that leaves us with about $12 and change to use, but it eliminates the rod, the reel, and I think the line. I don't know if I'm gonna be confident using this line, but let's see how much the line costs. 14 pound wouldn't be too bad. For 644 plus 11.84. So that leaves us with about six bucks. $1.96, perfect. All right. Got some bullet weights here, 94 cents. That will work. I think we're gonna go with the Strike King shimmy sticks. They're like in this watermelon red color, so that should do us really good. I'm filming a video where I'm, I'm making, I can only spend $25 on fishing equipment and I have to go and catch fish on only $25 worth of stuff. Oh. How much do you think this will all come out to? I hope it's 25 bucks, because that's all I got. Let's see. Maybe I can cancel it. Right. 1284, 644. 296. Come on, 25 bucks. Oh! 2665. All right, you know what? We'll let that slide. $1.65, we'll let it slide. Thank you. Thank Happy you. Take care. I got the goods. Now I did spend $26, a dollar and 60 cents over, but that is because I think I got the line. Now you may not need the line, but I wanted to make sure. So 
Let's go catch some fish. Sorry about the wind, guys, if there is a little bit. Florida is just weird with the weather right now. Most likely it'll rain in the next five seconds, but I do apologize in advance. Oh, there we go. Fish on. Punching these, <laughs> punching this mat. Got a little bass. First one on the Walmart setup. Sweet. I saw this matted area, and there's got to be bass under here, you guys. Little guy, but we will take him. First bass. Here we go. Thanks, bud. Go back to your home. Whoa. All right. Holy crap. My stuff. Nope, that's a fish. Oh, that is a good fish. <laughs> yes. Heck yes, you guys. Oh, that's a way better fish. Stay on, bud. Stay on. Stay on. Thought I was stuck. Woo! Dang! The Walmart setup is pulling through. Holy crap. I am digging this thing. 25 bucks, you guys. I already caught two fish. Both largemouth bass. And they just keep getting bigger and bigger. Heck yeah, you guys. Nice little pound, pound and a halfer. Walmart's coming through. I'm gonna let this guy go. See you later, bud. Thanks for shopping at Walmart. <laughs> All right, and here comes the rain. God. Non-stop for about eight days straight. Oh my God, I hate this place. So much rain. I'm literally just getting poured on right now. I'm soaked, but a challenge is a challenge and we're not gonna give up today. We've got a few hours. I mean, it's only like five o'clock. Hopefully all this passes, but it probably won't because it's been doing this all day. But we're still out here. We're trying. Oh! Yeah! Oh, he got off! All right, all right. We'll get him. Fish. Fish on. Oh, come on! Wait a minute, that may have been a snakehead. Oh my God. I had a nice fish on, man. Yeah. Here we go. Fish on. Please don't get off this time. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Oh, little guy. <laughs> Woo. Finally, finally got a freaking fish. Tiny little guy, my gosh. Not the biggest, no trophy fish, but we're struggling so hard today, we're gonna take him with the weather and our equipment, but a fish is a fish. See you later, bud. There he goes. Oh my God, there's another fish, you guys. Come on, I can't lose this fish. Oh, he's wrapped up. No. Wait, is he on? Well, oh, that fish is on. All right, I'm going in and getting him. See what I mean, you guys? It's so rough. Uh, oh, I got him. Oh, my God. <laughs> All this work for this baby-ass fish. Even this little, tiny little guy gave me all the trouble in the world. And now I'm stuck. Oh, my God. Get out of here, buddy. You're a tank fish. I should keep you for an aquarium. Get out of here. <sighs> this little fish put me in a world of hurt for a little tiny seven inch bass. And this is what you get with them. <laughs> so this Walmart setup does obviously work, but if you're fishing cover, go get braid, you guys. <laughs> I made the mistake of not getting braid.
Oh my god, are you joking right now? Did you guys just see that? Oh my god. That was the best last catch you could ever ask for. <laughs> that was incredible. I hope it is not too dark. Oh my god, what? Last cast of the literal night. I got caught on that little fountain over there. I was trying to snag it out, as you guys can see, and this guy crushed it. What? Oh my god, that was incredible. What a way to end the day for the challenge. There we go, you guys. Last bass on the setup from Walmart. $25 challenge, I'd say is complete. Wow, later, buddy. That was so freaking cool. That is it. I am done with this challenge. Now today, today was quite the challenge. Now it wasn't so much of the gear that really was challenging today, it was the weather. Now if you guys are keeping up with a lot of these other YouTube fishermen that live down here in South Florida, you guys know that the weather has just been complete shit. It's non-stop since Hurricane Irma has literally been non-stop rain, wind. We've had like two or three days of sun, but after that it's just been completely terrible, terrible weather. And it's actually gonna be continuing like that uh, within the next couple weeks. Gear that we had today, the Walmart setup did good. Now the one thing that I would have changed, which I would have went with braid. I, I definitely uh, suggest you guys go with braid. Now the reason why I didn't go with braid is because this was cheaper and I was trying to save money to hit the $25 mark. But today was great. Today hopefully I proved that you do not need expensive gear or crazy ridiculous rods and reels to catch fish. You can go out have fun for a low price. So if you're on a budget or a super budget, go out to Walmart, pick up a setup, and go and have fun and catch fish. That's the whole point of this challenge is to prove to you guys that it is possible. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It lets me know that you enjoy the content that I create for you. As always, everyone, thanks so much for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I will see you guys later.